And he's the greatest guy who ever lived, besides his uncle, in this swinging, casual winter getup. Figure skating, anyone? Hey, hey. I did not program this musical machine to ding dong. It's the door. Come in! Are you Schema? Is this your room? Yes and yes. Your mother sent me to fix the bed. I'm a carpenter. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, you're probably wondering what I'm doing half undressed in a tutu. To each his own, pal. Forget about him. Now, this is what I mean by style a la schema, huh? There we go. The shirt, the jacket, the tie, the pants, the shoes. It all says I'm a class guy who is basically a genius. Yet, there's something missing. The crown jewel of resistance. And what I refer to, of course, is the curve. <laughs> it says, I am schemer. <laughs> or I almost am. Sort of. Listen, grow it, care for it, cherish it always. <laughs> Tell you what, you just copy this and you're going to be fine, huh? So, any questions? Yeah, I got a question. Why are you telling everybody that they have to look and dress exactly like you? My friend, when something is successful, you let it succeed. I mean, don't you think this looks terrific? Maybe it's terrific for you, but it's not for me. But if you like it, you should wear it. That hey. doesn't mean I have to wear it. What is this, a guy who comes off the street presents? No, this is my video, and uh, I like the way that I dress. It is uh, uniquely unique. Yes, it is. I agree completely. It is. It is. I like it, too. It sure is, but if everybody dressed like that, then it wouldn't be style a la schema anymore. It wouldn't be unique. It would be boring. Like I said, pal, to each his own. Oh, so you're saying if everybody dressed like me, then I wouldn't be unique. Hey, I never thought of that before. I need a part from the truck. Don't sit on the bed. You can't let him talk to you like that, Uncle Schemer. Hey, don't bug me, boy. I'm about to bust into a song. Here we go. Ready? Just wear the right duds for the right occasion. Then wash them in suds at work or vacation. Wear them at school or at the zoo. But wear them only if they're right for you. They're only right for you. You got that right? That's right. Wear what you like, but make sure it's right for what you're doing. Now, as for uh, Style Owl Schemer, well, um, <laughs> I wouldn't worry about it personally, because let's be honest about it, you're never going to look as good as me anyway. <laughs> Uncle Schemer! Oh, 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 oh. Hey, Schemer, you better not be fooling around in front of that camera and waving to everybody at the home audience. Skinny, are you waving to the people in the home audience? Hey, Skinny, Skinny, you better not be fooling around in front of the camera out there waving to the home audience. Skinny? Skinny! Huh? Is that you in there, buddy? Skip, is that you? Okay, hold on. I'm gonna get you out. Oh, thanks. Watch out, son. Are you ready? Ready. Here we go. Oh, Hey, Skip. No problem. Hey, like the way you dressed. And I like this show. But that's it for now. Hey, I hope to be seeing you, seeing me next time when Schemer presents. Schemer presents. See ya. Like the way that guy's dressed, too. How to use the telephone. Uh, yeah, okay, Mommy, I promise. Yeah, I'll be there in about five... I miss. Uh, somebody just dropped the phone, yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll see you then. Uh, yeah, I'll be there in five minutes. Okay, bye-bye. Bye, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Mm, Hi there. I'm Schemer, and this is Schemer Presents. And today's lesson is... How to use the telephone. It's very important to use it properly and politely, because it's important to be polite and proper on the telephone. All right, now, uh... Part one of how to use a telephone. You hear that? That is the dial tone. 
Now, you uh, have to wait for the dial tone before you can actually dial a number. Oh. Hey, Dan, come on. What? Oh, oh hello, Mommy. Yeah, no, I, I, yeah, yeah, I'll be there in like uh, five minutes. I promise. That was somebody else dropping the phone again. Uh-huh. Okay. Bye-bye now. That was my mommy. She says she wants me to go to the store and get some food and then uh, eat lunch. Now, she's right, you know, because lunch is very important. It's almost like food for your body. Hey, Dan, come on, get over here. We gotta shoot this thing right... Hello, Mommy. No, I, I, what I meant was that we're gonna shoot right over there and uh, have some old lunch. No, that wasn't the phone dropping. It almost dropped, but didn't drop that time. Just kind of kissed the floor. <laughs> Love you, Mommy. Bye-bye. Okay. okay. Ooh. Ooh, hope it's Dan. It's Dan! Come on in, Dan. Dan, say hello to everybody. Hi. Uh, Dan has been kind enough to uh, help me show you how to use a phone. Now, Dan, there's your pretend phone. Here is Schemer's real phone. Now, first part we're going to do is how to answer a call. Now, Dan, you pretend to be calling me, please. If it had one, there's a line. Very good. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. I'm waiting for you to answer the phone. I'm waiting for you to do the ring ring part. The phone's okay. got a ring ring. Ring 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 ring. Very good. Hello. May I please speak to Schemer? Now, uh, watch this. I'm really good at it. To whom shall one kindly say is calling? Perhaps? Dan. Oh, Odd. Please hang up. Try your call again. <laughs> there's, there's some kind of like ro Robotron robot from outer space stuck in the, 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 the It's trying to make me go deaf or something. Did you hear that thing? Can you, 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 can, you can still hear. Please hang up. I can't believe it. Try your call there's, again. There is somebody. There's, a, there's somebody stuck inside my phone. There's a little tiny robot thing. I'm a genie stuck inside my phone. Hello? Can I help you? Do you need help in there? Little robot thing with jiggy stuck in my phone. Can I help you? Yes. This is not a toy. Yes, I know. I know it's not a toy. Hang up the phone. Okay. I promise I won't do it again. Who was it? It was the operator. That's who it was. She said you should never play with a telephone. It is not a toy. I repeat, not a toy. I know it's not a toy. I just said it's not a toy, and I mean it is not a toy. So we know it's not a toy. There. Ah. Let's move on, shall we? Now, what if the person you're calling isn't there? Okay, now what I'd like you to do at home is pretend that the phone is ringing. That's very good pretending. I can practically hear the phone myself. That's because it is ringing. That's because it is ringing. Of course, I don't think I knew that. But phones do, they ring, don't they? <laughs> hello? Oh, hello, Mommy. Uh, yes, uh, no, I, I, it's not a toy. Uh, it's not a toy. Food, food is just not a... Food is not a toy. So just when we eat it, we shouldn't play with it. Okay, I will. Thank you. Bye-bye. She wants me out of this house down over to the store and buying food and everything like that. She said, I have to eat my lunch today or I'm going to get any cocoa tonight. <laughs> He's going to take my cocoa away from me. What does she think she is, my mommy? You know what, Schemer? Well, all right. Now, uh, just uh, pretend that you're uh, you're calling me. Okay. Ring, 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 ring. Mm, all right. It. Hello? Uh, may I please speak to Schemer? Now, this is what you do if no one's home. I'm sorry. Schemer's not home right now. I'm busy. What you're supposed to do? No, don't. don't answer the phone. Just don't. Let's just, just, just don't answer the phone. Just, just don't answer it. If it's my mommy again and she finds I'm still here, it's curtains for the old schemer. So uh, let's just pretend that we're sleeping. Huh. Close your eyes and pretend you're sleeping. Don't touch the phone. Just don't touch the. Okay, if you're gonna answer the phone, then just wait a minute. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. Everything's fine. Tell them. Tell them. Whoever that I'm busy. So I can't come to the phone because I'm busy. Can't come to the phone. Uh, hello, schemer's residence. Yeah, this is Dan speaking. I'm sorry, but he can't come to the phone right now. Uh, may I take a message? Yes. Okay, I'll tell him. You're welcome. Bye. <laughs>